This right here is a relay. We find these in many units. Now it's getting uncommon to find as many relays as we used to. One reason is we use control boards, which usually have built-in relays in them. Great components, can last a long time, they cannot. This is a really old relay, if you can actually tell. They're really just taking 24 volts on this one, and that powers a coil and it just pulls in these contacts. And that's all you're doing is pulling in contacts so you can send out power to like your fan. This one's to actually control the fan. So it gets a 24 volts, pulls in those contacts, sends it out. Typical issues we see with these, coils can actually go bad. They can short out, that's pretty common. Also points can go out. One reason you don't see relays like this anymore is they usually enclose them. And enclosing them helps a little bit with not having those points go out as fast. The life expectancy on them can vary between two to 20 years. Price on replacing normal relays is usually anywhere from $260 and up. Lots of times you'll get little bugs that get in these relays. That's one reason you want them closed up. And that's where you see a lot of the problems is just little things that could be prevented. And that's one reason the industry has moved away from using just a relay.